Welcome back to the channel guys. For those of you who don't know who I am, I'm Ryan Ross and you should subscribe to this channel right now. On this channel, we review anything and everything so you guys do not have to. I also like to grill and smoke meat and I stream Call of Duty Warzone every other night or every night. So tune into the stream if you wanna see us win some dubs on those maps. But today, got Deb's Tech 420 piece accessory kit for a rotary tool. It doesn't matter if you got the DM180 by Deb's Tech or a Dremel, um, it will work with either or. This 420 piece kit is a steal. I mean, I'm not talking about, a, it's like you're robbing them blind, guys. This is 29 bucks. It comes with everything you possibly could need for your Dremel or your DM180 rotary tool. They have a bundle going on. It's only $59.99, guys. It's a steal. That machine is a beast. You can check out my other video right here. It's a crazy beast, and I highly recommend it over like a Dremel or any other rotary tool. But let's jump into this box and see what we got. This is what comes in the box. I love hard cases for travel and storage purposes. It's really nice to have these cases, especially once they're all like nice and organized in here too as well. It's always good to have. So let's go ahead and open this up. Holy moly, there's so much nice. It's nicely packed in here and um, there's so much to choose from. So right here you got your drill bits. It's gonna probably be all for woodworking. Um, fine stone these are going to be for your discs such as these discs and then you got some wire brushes that's like a brass you got this is like a nylon black nylon this is your stainless and then you got these are for your sandpaper rolls or cylinders sandpaper cylinders you got stone again different grit stone different grit stone then you got your like scotch bright kind of um i guess sandpaper not sandpaper but you know scotch bright just kind of gets rust off and all that stuff and then again bigger stainless steel brushes you got your nylon brass and then you got your cylinder or wheel brushes stainless i don't know what these nylons are for i'm curious what you can use those for but the nylon black nylon and then your brass and then you got different grades of sandpaper. Um, let's just check them out. Holy moly. They're overflowing how many they packed in here. They've had to pack like a hundred of them in here. Holy moly. Look at this. This thing is overflowing with all the sandpaper that they sent. Like it literally shot the cap off. It's crazy bunch of different sandpapers I'm, I'm guessing it's gonna be different grades grit so I don't know what's why does this look so okay so I think this is gonna be polishing paste that's why I, I was like what in the world is that but I'm pretty sure this is for polishing yeah so this red stuff is gonna be for polishing stuff um, then it goes into Yep, different sandpapers again. And I'm gonna just assume that these are all sandpaper. These might be, yeah, so these are gonna, these are like little cut off discs. These are kind of solid. I think these are probably cut off discs too. Yep, and these are all kind of like sandpapers and then polishing paste. Um, then you got other cut off wheels. And then you got your your cylinder sandpapers, different grits, smaller dia or diameter and bigger diameter. Um, polishing wheels, your different tips of polishing wheels. And then you got this like really, I forgot what these are called, but super fine polishing um, for like jewelry or something. Something in that case, really nice. I have actually never used one of those before. And then you got these guys. These guys are going to be a really thick stone um, for whatever use you use these for. And then a finer, finer grit one. What are these? What is this stone? 
what are these stone sand, uh, blocks for? I, I don't know how I'm supposed to use this. Is this to like clean off excess or the grind at it to, for what? Like, what am I grinding at this for? So let me know in the comments, guys. I could probably look it up, but uh, I want to ask you guys what, what these are for. I see these all the time and I, I never use it. And then you got your wrench and stuff like that. You got different adapter pieces. You got your diamond plated plate to cut glass. And then you got your cylinder sandpaper to get into round areas. This is gonna be nice to have. It's 80 grit sandpaper. And uh, different, different long cutoff wheels, a lot of those. Got a whole bunch of those. It's pretty neat. But yeah, I mean, guys, look at this kit. Dude. This is, I'm not joking. This kit is 29 bucks. You get 420 different pieces for your accessory kit. And I'm not lying to you. I have one of these. This exact piece right here, this this uh, bit right here. And uh, I bought it from Ace Hardware. The same similar one, it costed me twelve dollars twelve dollars separately just just this thing from like i think it was like a dremel brand or a different brand of whatever at ace hardware and i know ace hardware is expensive but this one piece not this one from this kit but i have one in my toolbox twelve dollars for this alone that is crazy and this is 29 bucks so i like i why wouldn't you want to go with this a kit like this? I mean, it makes no sense. This, when I bought all this stuff for my Dremel, wasn't in stock. They didn't have these brands or companies being competitive. They had the name, big name brands, and they were charging whatever freaking price they wanted to charge because there's no one competing against them. Now there are competitors and they are making it a no-brainer to go with one of these kits versus those other brands. It just makes no sense, guys. I'm telling you, go with this DM180 and go with this accessory kit. They have a bundle for 60 bucks. You get this kit, you get a whole bunch of little accessories that comes with this, and then you get this 420 kit, piece kit. Makes no sense. Go with this kit, guys. 60 bucks for this and this and a little bit more accessories in the other box. like. What the hell are you guys doing? Why aren't you guys buying this right now? Link will be in the description below. You can, or you can go check them out on Amazon. Just search Debs Tech DM180. They have a bundle kit, or just buy this tool separately. Whatever the case is, I'm I'm just really really happy with it, guys. I, I don't know how else to explain it. I mean, I've thrown it a couple times already, like dropped it. I mean, and uh, still still working, going pretty strong, and uh, yeah, no problems, no problems with it at all. So highly recommend it. Well, that's it guys. That's the review for the 420 piece accessory kit by Debs Tech. I cannot recommend this tool and brand enough to you guys. Low priced, high performance, everything you're gonna want in a rotary tool. Just go throw out your Dremel right now. Swear to you, this is a beast. If you guys find this video helpful, please smash that like button. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good one, later.